Hello friends, how are you all? Hope you are doing well. So today I have come up with a new uh, book, a new story. That's The King's New Cloak. It's about the king's new cloak. This is also by Wonder House Publications. The price here mentioned is 3.99 US dollar but uh, I... Sorry for which I do not remember the price which I purchased from India that is from Amazon but I'm pretty sure this cost me within 100 rupees. This has very few pages and let's see what is the story about. What is the story is about to say. The King's New Cloak Snarky the Hyena has a magical cloak that can make king long locks invisible or can it find out by reading this modern retelling of the emperor's new clothes yes it is so this is what about the king who is wearing a different cloth I'm pretty sure you might be finding it very dramatic and very different it's not usual it's very unusual such kind of clothes so it's also here as is a king king always put cloak cloak is just it's kind of backside they put a cloth uh, which is sleeveless uh, they just put it at the backside like the king when goes walks at the backside just keep flying just behind them so a piece of cloth is known as cloak so the king's new cloak the story is about king's new cloak Let's find out what is it about. This is how it looks. So let's see what is the story. The king lock, long locks loved clothes. All kinds of clothes. So the king name is long locks. Long locks loved clothes. He loved all kinds of clothes. See how, uh, what is the kind, means how does it look like when he puts cloak and clothes like this. He is watching himself in the mirror. So what is it about? He always tried to be different. But the clothes he liked best were strange clothes. But the clothes he liked best were strange clothes. Unusual clothes. Clothes that were different. The clothes which he wear is very strange, unusual and were different from others. Yes, he love wants to look different. So that's why his clothes are pretty unusual it's very different it's not common see the next day how he is wearing do I like this kind of cloth okay one day a clever hyena so this is the hyena I guess he was a very clever hyena named Snarky came to the palace. The hyena name is Snarky. Your Majesty, he said. The hyena said, Your Majesty, I have a cloak that will make you invisible. In fact, I have it right here. He held up his paws. So hyena came to king's palace king lock long luck's palace and said your majesty i have brought a piece of magical cloak in cloak means kings always put a different type of cloaks behind his like a king do he's wearing clothes and at the back side they put a cloak or they wear a cloak from behind just to look like a emperor or a king so he said, I have brought a magical cloak. 
which can make you invisible like if you put on it you won't be visible to anyone and he was showing this is the magical cloak which you can see it on my paws is it can something can be that magical that uh, if they put it on the um, on the body they will be invisible i have never seen let's find it out so amazing said the king king said amazing i can't even see it exactly said the hyena and this magic cloak can be yours for only one bag of gold king after listening to this great idea this hyena put the cloak on top of means he tried to put like this paws but there was no cloak he can see so the king said amazing there is no cloak you are holding and i can't see cloak i can't even see it the hyena said exactly this is a magical cloak how will you see so oh, sorry i misinterpreted behind this page i thought this is the cloak but this is not the cloak this is his cap he said the cloak is a magical cloak so he is just showing his paws empty paws holding none of the piece of cloth so he said uh, amazing said the king i can't even see it exactly said the hyena and this magic cloak can be yours for only one bag of gold the hyena said to the king like yeah this is invisible but this can be yours only if you give me one bag full of gold done said king long locks king long locks said okay done i will give you one bag full of gold and i'm very excited now help me try it on he said help me you take one bag full of gold so here is the bag full of gold and put the cloak behind me so this is how the hyena tried to fool the king long lock so what happened next let's see suddenly said snarky of course the cloak works best if you don't wear anything under underneath it this snarky the hyena said if you do not wear anything under this not even your clothes then the cloak works better the cloak will work much better if you do not wear your clothes of course said the king the king said of course agreed the king taking off his royal clothes snarky pretended to place the cloak around him when he just took off all his clothes the king has taken away all his clothes then snarky the hyena tried and pretended to put that cloak around him which was invisible itself so he has just put the cloak which was invisible to everyone on behind the king your highness snarky announced you are now invisible now this hyena clever hyena said you highness you are now invisible no one can see you now you are invisible now so what happened next let's see whether he is actually invisible nobody is able to see him ha huh. look at the king's confidence 
as if is invisible let's see the king couldn't wait to try out his cloak he marched out of his palace and straight to the village square the king was so much restless to use that cloak and go out in the public and to feel like he was never been watched by anyone and to enjoy his ride outside the animals were startled to see their king with no clothes on the animals were able to see the king without clothes and they were startled they were shocked they were surprised they were so shocked that they looked everywhere except at him due to this shame they were not able to see or look into the king's eyes so they just looked everywhere else except at the king why did they do so out of the shame out of the respect they didn't even look at the king as he was not putting on his cloth and see how bravely he was walking as if nobody could see him no one sees me thought king lock long locks happily i am i really am invisible now the king lock long locks thought yes it is walking now i am invisible nobody can see me no one is looking at me he actually thought no one was looking at him just because they can't see him but the real thing is everybody was were able to see him but out of respect that the king was not putting his clothes were not looking at him while he was coming so let's find out next ha huh, then what happened just then a little mouse began to laugh so this mouse began to laugh ha 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 look everyone he shouted look everyone the king has no clothes on ha 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 look everyone he shouted the king has no clothes on wait said the king wait said the king you can see me little mouse king said you little mouse can you see me i sure can said the mouse i sure can said the mouse and everyone else can too mouse said i can see you along with me everyone else in the village can see you then what the king was so much shocked after listening to the mouse what did he do he do the king raced back to his palace the king then just raced back ran very fast to his palace he didn't come out for a very very long time he didn't the king didn't come out of his palace for very long time and somewhere snarky that clever hyena is still laughing and the hyena as he made him full naughty hyena the clever hyena was really very happy to see all this and was laughing so this is about this beautiful story of the king's new cloak i hope you like the story if you have anything to discuss with any questions you can uh, let me know in the comment section below thank you take care bye bye